Hey guys, during the break of the video, we had to do a requested album review. Here yeah, I'm going to review Death Magnetic by Metallica. And don't worry guys, I will review uh, the previous albums uh, again eventually. But uh, this was requested by a good friend and subscriber of mine, so let's do this. For him, yes. First song is That Was Just Your Life. Um, great song, heavy riffs, and it's got some great lyrics, and um, a pretty long song, and it's repetitive, but in a good way. Really entertaining song, That Was Just Your Life. I'd give that song 8 out of 10. Next song is The End of the Line. Another really good song. Not as good as that was just your life in my opinion, but still really entertaining. Um, uh, um, it's got some heavy riffs, and the song just gets better and better as it goes on. Okay, I give the end of the line an 8 out of 10. Now here's where the album really picks up. Third song is Broken, Beat, and Scarred. This is just a fantastic song. A lot of a really heavy riffs. Just an awesome, catchy song to listen to. Great throughout, never gets boring. But not perfect in my opinion, but a great ass song. I'd give Broken, Beat, and Scarred a 9 out of 10. Fourth song, and in my opinion, the best song on the album, is The Day That Never Comes. What needs to be said about this song that has a metal already? It is absolutely flawless. It is amazing. Um, just really. <sighs> and it blends in the soft and heavy guitar riffs in such a good way. Amazing song, one of Metallica's best ever. I'd give The Day That Never Comes a 10 out of 10. Best song in the album, I think. That song. It's all night near long. This was a really long song, and there's not too much lyric in it, but it's just a heavy and at times fast, incredible song to listen to. Fantastic, fantastic song, especially the riffs and the way the vocals tie in with the guitar riffs. It's just brilliant. I give all night near long a 9.5 out of 10. It is near perfect in my opinion. Next song is Cyanide. This song was just holy shit. This song is just so many like nerdgasms all in one. Just extremely heavy and thrashy and just you just love the hell out of it. Makes you jump up and down. And it's just an awesome, awesome song. Epic Cyanide song. I give Cyanide a 10 out of 10. Second best song in the album, my opinion. Not as good as Day That Never Comes, in my opinion, but still an awesome, awesome song. Amazing song, Cyanide. Not gonna say Timothy. Next song is The Unforgiven Three. Okay, the first minute of the song was beautiful. It was incredible. But the rest of the song is still good, but not as good as the first minute of the song. But the rest of the song. Was like the first minute, it would be probably the best on the album. I'm definitely saying, it. but no, it's not. I mean, the rest of the song is good, but the first minute is definitely, definitely the best part. So that's Unforgiven 3. Next is, in my opinion, the worst song on the list, and that is The Judas Kiss. Okay, um, this is probably a filler song. I mean, it's still good. But there are some catchy riffs, but nothing too much to talk about. I'd give the Judas Kiss a seven out of ten. Worst song in the album, I don't know. But it's still next is Suicide and Redemption. Uh, an instrumental song by Metallica. This is a pretty entertaining song. Well a bit repetitive and rather overlong. I still think it's a really entertaining song. Second worst song in the album, um I'd say much better than Judas Kiss, but still a great, 
I mean, not great, but still pretty good instrumental in my opinion. 7 out of 10. It's got some heavy riffs, which I think is the best part of it. Last song is My Apocalypse. This is an awesome song. I mean, I mean, not awesome, but a great, great song. I mean, just listen to it. And there's some heavy guitar riffs that just make it entertaining throughout. And I think it is a great song and a great way to end the album. My Apocalypse, I'm going to give it an 8.5 out of 10. So that's my review of Death Magnetic, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Like I said, I will review the other albums um, that I skipped from Metallica uh, one day. Eventually, okay. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment, like, peace.